it's inside 1 and 0. Hit high and deep to right center. Long run for the center fielder. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. In now, Jones. He went deep in the contest last night. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A very comfortable afternoon for baseball. 61 degrees, our game time temperature. Swing and a miss, and he's in trouble now, 0-2. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Digging in, Jones. No career at bats for him against this particular arm in the past. Ball one. Ball one, no fight. Hit down the third baseline, but a foul ball, one and one. And the pitch. Hit hard to the right side. Foul. The one two. Yanked on the ground down the line. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Tough pitch to lay off there, but he did, and it's even up at two and two. Tough to take a pitch like that right there, especially in a one two count. You almost get in that auto swing mode. Great job to work the count back to even. Hit on the ground out to short. Baez fields it cleanly. Off balance throw gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. Stepping in, Javier Baez. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Now here's the pitch. Fastball just misses. That's ball one. Swing and there it goes. He got all of that ball into the bleachers and gone. So that'll bring up Jason Hayward. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. Jones is just getting his big league pitching career underway, of course, but he did recently pick up his first and only win. A ball and a strike. Threw that fastball right by him. He had no chance to get the barrel to that one. And it's one and two. Let's get it going, boys. Somebody's loose, hitting 98 with ease in the first inning. The one two. Lifted down the line in left. Smith trying to get there. He takes the turn and heads for second. And that one skips up over the wall for a ground rule double. Digging in next will be Chris Bryant. As the first pitch here is a bit high, it's ball one. And he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Swing and a miss as he ramps up on the fastball one and one. Ball and a strike now to Bryant. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Stepping into the box, Wilson Contreras. And a great chance here for the Cubbies to add on in just the first inning. He set and the pitch. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 1. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. Center fielder looking up. This one's into the bleachers and gone. Anthony Rizzo stands in now. Fouled off. 
Jones has both great strikeout stuff and exceptional command on the mound to go with it. A rare combination, but one that makes him one of the best in our sport. Matty V, you talked about it. He doesn't walk a whole lot of guys. Well, if you don't walk a lot of guys, that means you have to throw the ball in the strike zone. And when you do with great stuff like this guy has, he racks up the strikeouts. There aren't a lot of guys that get strikeouts by throwing the ball in the strike zone. This is one of the few that does it. Ooh, started him with the change, and it's nothing in one. Ooh, that's a good pitch to take a hack at right there. Change up, up in the zone. Eh, he'd like to have that one back. One and one to Schwarber. Three runs already home here. Swung on and missed that strike two. That one bends around the zone and it's two and two. Tried to work in the backdoor breaking ball there for a strikeout, but he just couldn't quite get it to come back to the corner. Threw it right past him, a swing and a miss at the gas, and that is. Second inning set to go, and that'll bring in the first year catcher, Donnell Jones. Pitch on the way. Now a drive out to the gap in right center. Running hard, he's digging for second. And he's not stopping, he wants three. The relay, but he is in there with a triple. To the plate now, Keith Cobra. This is in the air out to right. Hayward has a read on it. He's got it one away. And they will not try running on that arm. Wisely so as he holds on tight with one away now. Stepping up now, Smith. Nine at-bats in the series and four base hits. And looked like he jammed him that time a bit as it's hit in the air to center field. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And the run is in to score from third. It's now a three to one ball game. Set to get his day started, Julian Smith. And it's been a real struggle for him with the bat so far this year, looking to get things turned around in a hurry. See you later. Into the box, Jay Terry. Back up the middle. And the inning will continue as that's through for a two-out hit. Stepping in now, D.J. Jones. Grounder down the line at third. On to Kipnis at second, and the inning is over. Settling in now, Ian Happ, and he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Here's the first pitch to him. And that's swung on and missed on a pitch down, one and one. And he pumps the fastball by him here. One and two now. That was some smoke right there. High fire right on by. And they'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. He might have to look for a different way to put this guy away on two two. He's already seen the curveball a couple of times, so he might be looking for it. Fouled away. The 2-2 one more time. He is swung on and missed. He got him. And is the second baseman, Jason Kipnis. He's gone over his first six at-bats in the series so far. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. The 1-0. Ball and two strikes now. Get it ready, big boy. This guy's throwing three digits right here. 
The best way I can help the fans is 90 to 92, you can usually see seams. 92 to 95, it starts to really quicken up on you. Over three digits, you're seeing a white blur. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. He is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Now in the box, Kyle Hendricks will attempt to put the ball in play for a change here with the first two guys going down on strikes to start the inning. The pitch. And he fouls this one off. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Hit down the line at first, but this will get foul for strike two. The 0-2 delivery. And he got another one here. He strikes out the side. He set down five in a row via the punch out, and the inning is over. Coming to the plate now, Anthony Jones. He flew out in his last at bat. Almost, Matty. Almost Anthony. went deep his last no. AB. Certainly just missed it. There's a swing and a drive, and everybody's just going to sit back and watch that one fly. A no doubt home run. Standing in now, Jones. As he rips it on the ground to second. Taken in by Kipnis on the first. So a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. So striding in, Jones. One run in and one gone so far in this inning. In front of the change up there as this is chopped foul at home plate. Another one fouled off and he's quickly behind 0-2. Bases are empty, one man out. He sends it out to left field. Well hit. See you later. In now, Donnell Jones. Found his way over to third via a triple in his first at bat. The windup and the 0 1. And opposite field as he lines this down the line in right. And that's a fair ball heading out toward the 353 sign on the Ivy. Digging hard. He's headed for third. And it's in time as he's out at third as the good relay gets him. Into the box now. Keith Cobra. So go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. A swing and a ground ball to third. Throw to first will get him easily and the side is retired. Bottom of the inning now, and stepping in is the veteran shortstop, Javier Baez. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. And that's taken for strike one. Pitcher wants to have a quick inning right here, capitalize on the momentum his batters have. Swing and a miss, and he's in control, 0-2. Oh, and they still have no answer for him up there. Six straight punch outs now, and there's one away. So in now for Chicago, Jason Hayward. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Down the first baseline. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Below the zone, a swing and a miss. They obviously had a pretty good gauge on that first heater right there. He was super aggressive, thought he was getting another one. Slowed him down with the curveball. That's the cat and mouse. To one and two now. Make it seven in a row. My gracious, he is simply unhittable right now. Two away. Now 
So bases are empty here with two gone. And that'll bring up Chris Bryant. Big curveball swung on and missed 0 and 1. Hey, he's done an amazing job of settling down. Two innings ago, I thought they were going to run him out of here. But now he's close to posting two shutout innings as a response. Behind 0 and 2 now. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Eight straight strikeouts. You got to be kidding me. The inning is over. Standing in, Smith. He hit a sack fly earlier. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Down the third baseline. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. At the plate, Julian Smith. He went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. It'll be interesting to see if they use that changeup in this at bat. That last at bat, that was a changeup he hit for a home run. I'm going to see if this time they don't go to more fastballs and curveballs. At the plate, Jay Terry. Here's a shot to left field and deep. Look at this. See you later. Well, this is what makes this guy so hard to pitch to. He has that rare combination of speed and power. You don't want to walk him and have him get on first base. So what happens, you throw him a strike, and he can hit the ball all the ballpark like he did just there. Into the box, DJ Jones. This is chopped down the third baseline. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Now here it comes. Weak grounder down the line at third. Throw gets him. Two down. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Anthony Jones. He comes in 1 for 2 with that home run he hit earlier. Grounded weakly to the left. And he overshoots his first baseman as it's over his head. Digging in now, Jones. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Yeah, Maddie, and it looked like a sinker in his last A-B that got him to roll over. Kind of similar situation right here. Similar stuff on the mound. Look for them to try and get him to do exactly the same thing as his last A.B. He's got to fight to get it elevated just a little bit more. Now the 2-0 home. Oh, forget about this one. Bob Bob Booey. See you later. Boy, this guy's hot right now. Hit a bomb yesterday and hit another tape measure shot today. When he gets hot, he hits him in bunches. This could be the beginning of one of those extended hot streaks. Jarrell Cotton answers the call from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from their starter. So now to the plate, Jones. As he'll swing and miss at a first pitch slider at strike one. He's working on a one for two game so far. And it's quickly 0 and 2. Nothing in two count and the pitch. High in the air out to center field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away and that ends the inning. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And next to hit is the catcher, Wilson Contreras. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on. But you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle. And one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Hit on the ground out to short. And there's one away. So one gone in the yeah, inning, man. and that will bring up the first, first baseman, baseman, Anthony Rizzo. Anthony. Here's the pitch. 
And he'll look at a fastball that doesn't miss by a whole lot. It's 1-0. Oh. Man, this guy has retired a whole slew right now. I think what he needs to do is just stay focused and keep attacking the game plan like he has up to this point because everything he's done has worked. A ball and two strikes to Anthony Rizzo. Hey, you think back to the early innings right there. You thought this guy would have been hitting the showers. A credit to him. He's been able to regroup, find his mechanics, and find a way to stay in this game. And he struck him out. The 10th victim set down on strikes thus far. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Kyle Schwarber is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. You rarely see a pitcher of this quality throw one right down the middle. And man, as a hitter, probably a good chance you're not going to see that pitch again. Behind 0-2 now. Pitch on the way. And yet another strikeout here. His 11th of the ball game, and this one ends the inning. All set for the start of the inning, and now it'll be the catcher, Donnell Jones. Here's the first pitch to him. Wind up and the 0 1. Uh, no plate discipline that time, and he's in the hole now, 0 and 2. Line shot to first, and there's one away. Digging in once again, Keith Cobra. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, I understand that, Matty, but this guy's got burner wheels down the first baseline. I don't think he even concerns himself with that. He has to put it on the ground. That's part of what makes him successful. Number 14. So striding forward now, Smith. He was a ground out victim last time up. First pitch of the at bat. A ball and no strikes. Bases are empty here with two men out. One and one. Hey, this pitcher better be careful right here. My man at the plate is not trying to push something to the opposite field. And it's fouled away. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one, two. Still a ball and two strikes. Again, a one, two. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first and no swing. It's ball two. The 2-2. Two -two. And this ball is also hit foul and heading for the seat, so we'll have to do it again. Still two and two. A little too much bite on the breaking ball that time as it's well off the outside. Hey, this guy's a hard guy to put away. He's fouling off some tough pitches. 2-2 two -two count, and he just seems to keep hanging right in there. Hayward is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. And that'll bring in the Pittsburgh area native Ian Happ. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going. And the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the eighth and ninth inning. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. And he takes strike two. Can't quite get around in time to keep it fair, and it remains 0 2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. Uh, and he's just rolling right now, and even dozen strikeouts for him in the ballgame. Now batter. Into the box now, Jason Kipnis. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Here's the pitch. 
And that's in there for strike one. That elevated fastball right there. That is the biggest change in the game today for me. When I first came up, a lot of guys working that Greg Maddox east to west. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. A ball and two strikes to Kipnis. Those were two great executed pitches right there away from this batter. He can hurt you in a heartbeat. I don't think anything's going to leak out over the heart of the plate. The one-two. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. David Bodie will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 13. David Bodie. This pitch is taken on the inner half for strike one. And they go away here. It's a cold strike. Nothing in two. I get it. He wants to see this guy's repertoire, but now he's behind in the count. Puts himself in a tough spot to hit. And he's going to add to the total. 14 punch outs now as that ends the inning. Alec Mills is into the ball game now as he'll make his fifth appearance of the season here. Number 30. Alec. New inning set to get underway and stepping up as the shortstop, Julian Smith. Leading off for the Panther. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Julian Smith. Great job of changing speeds there. It's 0-2. Pitcher's got options here. He looked a little bit out front. Might be able to rush a fastball by him. Fouled off. The 0-2 once more. Fouled away. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. This is a fun guy to watch when he's up there. Really battles. Doesn't take any pitches off. He's a grinder. Always seems to make it difficult on the opposing pitcher. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Now back. Ready to take his hacks again. Jay Terry as he'll look to follow up the two-run homer he launched over the wall last time up. Starts him with a good rising fastball there for strike one. Behind 0-2 now. One out, nobody on. Hit in the air down the right field line. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. And on 0-2, he misses with a fastball. A swing and a miss. He offered it a ball way outside the strike zone for out number two. Now that so here now is the pitcher, DJ Jones. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. Fastball well outside. One and one the count now. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right and that'll move the count to one and two now. Trying to strike out the side. Here it is. Bryant's got it. Throw to first in plenty of time and the side is retired. Bottom of the sixth inning now and coming forward now is the shortstop Javier Baez. Not your stop. Javier. Javier.
ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And he fouls this one off. The wind up and the 0 1. High in the air out to center field. Center fielder on the run. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. So one away in the inning, and that'll bring in the dangerous bat of Jason Hayward, the right fielder. First offering on its way. Bases are empty, one man out. And this one's down the middle, a ball and a strike. Ball and two strikes. One and two. Got him. And that's number 15 for the ball game. Into the box now. Chris now Bryant. That. 0 for 2 the on the afternoon so far. Oh, yeah. First pitch coming. Here it is. Swing and a miss on the slurve. Strike one. And he falls behind 0-2. Three runs, three hits. One error for the Cubs to this point. up and the 0-2 pitch not a bad pitch there with two strikes but it misses one and two hit hard up the middle he's got it they'll whip this one to first in time and that ends the inning Rowan Wick is into the ball game now as he'll make his fifth appearance of the season here. Digging in to try it again, Anthony Jones. He reached base on an error and later came around to score last time up. Here's the first pitch to him. Hit hard to the right side. Foul. Moves the fastball there. This is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. See you later. Now that number twenty-two to the plate. Now Jones. Yes, he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. He's working on a one for three thus far. 0 oh, and 1 count and the pitch. Curveball. Swing and a miss, and he's behind in the count 0 oh and 2. Offered at that breaking ball below the zone, and that's a tough one to spit on. But the key is recognizing it coming out of the pitcher's hand earlier and making sure that it goes up before it comes down. More likely to be a hanger when that's the case. Now another 0 oh 2. Breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Contreras recovers, but the batter's going to take first easily after striking out. Digging in, Jones. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And it's fouled away. Hit hard on the ground is short. Baez has it. There's one. On to Rizzo at first, and they get them both. So base is empty now after the double play. And digging in is the big time power threat, Donnell Jones. First delivery to him on the way. 
Count one and oh. Wanted to get the front door curveball on the inside corner there, but it backed up a little and stayed off the corner. The 1 0 -oh. is swung on and missed in that strike one. High in the air out towards shallow right. Hayward has a read on it, makes the catch, and that'll Ladies retire the side. For the traditional seventh inning stretch. So here's the cleanup hitter, Wilson Contreras. One for two in the ball game thus far. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. Hey, there's an old saying in baseball, you need to take a strike in this spot. Well, he got one there. Now he just needs to find a way to get on. Comes back with a fastball up and away that swung on and missed 0-2. Even though we're late into this ball game, this guy's veal is still top notch. This guy's a horse. Struck him out. Strikeout number 16 thus far, as he's had a whale of a ball game. And that'll bring Anthony Rizzo to the plate. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. First pitch of the at bat. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one, and it's strike one. There's a pitch we haven't seen in a while. It's going to be tough on the hitters if they have to incorporate that into their mindset. In there, and he's ahead 0-2 now. Three runs, three hits. One error for the Cubs to this point. And another one. Strikeout number 17 in the ball game as he keeps now racking him up. Ready once again, Kyle Schwarber. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. And he throws the fastball by him here, 0 and 1. Man, that's seven straight strikes to start this inning. He's got a chance at an immaculate inning. A swinging strike, and now it's 0 and 2. Hey, and the beat goes on. That's number eight. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. The next 0 2. Here is a ground ball now for the shortstop to the right of second. And that will conclude matters here in the seventh. Digging in, Keith Cobra. Leading off for the Panther. The right field. Keith Cobra. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Hit sharply on the ground. There's Baez. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Ready now, now Smith. And he hasn't Number quite 14. had the same fortune at the plate as many of his teammates. No hits for him so far. Fouled off. One out, nobody on. Barely able to make contact. Down 0 and 2 now. It looked like the fastball got away from him there. Basic pitching right there. 0-2 fastball up and out of the zone. Changed the eye level. Now time to go to that curveball down and away. This one's outside. Quite a bit off the plate that time. And a liner foul into the seats down the right side. The 2 2 one more time. Fouled away. Hit high and deep out to straightaway left. And that'll hit off the Ivy out there. And he is in at second base with a one-out double. 
number two. Standing in now, Julian Smith. As the first pitch to him is off the plate for a ball, 1-0. Oh. And he drops it. Throw on to first, two gone. Striding in once again, Jay Terry. Runner in scoring position with two gone. He's ready now, the pitch. And he waves at a curveball there. No balls in a strike. Breaking ball. That's in the dirt as he takes a ball. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. High and deep to right center. Hayward giving chase. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Digging in the switch hitter, Ian Happ. Over two on his line thus far. The center fielder, Ian. First pitch of the at bat on its way. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. And he fouls this one off. Swing and a miss on a pitch outside. One and two now. Hey, I know it's a day game, but these guys better wake up. He's on point today, throwing a lot of exploding stuff, darting and diving all over the strike zone. And that's into the corner, a foul ball in right. The one two. He yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. One two pitch is a bit high and he's back to even at two and two. What we're seeing here is a really smart at bat. They got to be thinking the man on the mound is getting a little short on gas. So when you go up there and make him throw a bunch of pitches, you're more likely to get a good pitch to hit or at least force him out of the game. Leone Kella will come on out of the bullpen as he'll be appearing in his third game this season. Got him. And that's the third time we've written a K next to his name in this one. The next cub up, Jason Kipnis. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing and one. And here's one that misses to the Chicago second baseman. It's a ball and a strike. The 1-1 home is swung on and missed, and that's strike two. And it's fouled away. Now another 1-2. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. Victor Caratini will grab a bat Number and hit for seven. the pitcher here. Victor. First pitch fastball oh, swung on and missed 0 1. On, could we see another strikeout here? It's 0 2 now. I know this guy has a lot of weapons on the mound, but what makes him so successful is that he's aggressive. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Craig Kimbrell comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. Craig Kimbrell.
set to start the ninth in this one. And next will be the pitcher, Keone Kella. The pitcher, Keone. Becomes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. And we kick off the ninth inning with a swinging strike here. Nothing and one. Liner towards second, but an Adam Bull right to him for the first down. Digging in and looking for more, Anthony Jones. He's two for four in the ball game. And that last at bat when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down and in and out and try not to throw it right down the middle of the plate. Oh, one count. Here's the pitch. Here's one, one that misses high. It's one and one. Just off the end of the bat, it's a foul ball, and he'll stick around. The one and two pitch. Now a swing, and he popped him up, straight up, as this is right around home plate. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. Now batting, Jones. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. Pitch on the way. Got him to reach out of the zone for that one. Strike one. That's just too much velocity upstairs to get good wood on it. It's going to have to lower his sights. Way inside with that one. A pretty easy take there. Now the one and one pitch. Hopped up. And Rizzo able to make the catch. All set for the bottom of the ninth. And into bat next, the versatile weapon, Javier Baez. Hey, it's never easy scoring runs against a closer, but this lineup is setting up perfectly right now as the leadoff hitter leads off this inning. Here's a fly ball well hit. Right fielder giving chase, but he won't have a play. This is down and into the gap. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Now batter, the right field, Jason Hayward. Here's Jason Hayward now. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Center fielder on the run, but he's not going to get there, and he's headed for extra bases again. Baez rounds the corner and is headed home. He comes across to score, and the deficit now stands at five. The third base Here's Chris Bryant now. So Brown, this one fouled off to the left side. He could really use a knock here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0 and 2. 0 2 count. You could do just about anything you want right now. Up, down, in, out, hard, soft. Good time to be a pitcher. Hit to third. Throw on to first, and one third baseman grounds out to the other, one away. Now the Cubs four-hole hitter, Wilson Contreras. A couple of RBIs for him already, and a chance for more here. A high fastball is in there. And he gets a piece of this one to foul it toward the backstop. Here comes the nothing in two pitch. Yep, I'm going Stone cold take right there. That fastball very well could have sent him packing back to the bench. The one two is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Now at the plate, Anthony Rizzo. And he needs to make something happen. They're down to their final out here in the ninth. First pitch coming. Here it is. Yanked high and deep down the line in right. And it's a foul ball. Swing and a miss, and they're up against it now as they're down to their final strike of the afternoon. He knows full well he's sitting on a hat trick right here. All he's trying to do is avoid the golden sombrero. A ball and two strikes now. The Cubs are down to their final strike here. Yank fouled off to the right.
has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. Now a foul tip right into the catcher's glove as he holds on, and the ball game is over. You can just see that the confidence is radiating off of them out there right now. That's six wins in a row, and this looks like a train that's not about to slow down anytime soon. And this ball game ends at a 9-4 final score. The Panthers launched six home runs as a team in the ball game. DJ Jones earns the win his second, and mark him down for 17 strikeouts to boot. Kyle Hendricks struggled and gets the loss after giving up six earned. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Fans are final line score. First for the victorious visiting team, nine runs.